Killing 1000 RTO without banking is insanity and will be the hardest challenge I have ever done. RTO outputs massive damage whilst having a special attack that hits up to 50 damage, as well as these traps that make escaping very hard. I've decided on range as this is the only way to take no damage if I do the boss perfectly, and I'll be also risking a massive 750 mil. This special attack is insanely dangerous, but you can actually counter it by praying mage. I need to make sure I get this one correct. First KC and we've already got some super restores. These supply drops are going to be the only reason why this boss is going to be possible for me. But it does not drop bruise. That means I only have 7 which is a very small amount. Wait the boss is not frozen. What? You can actually splash on the Callisto. I need to get used to that. That is really really bad. Look at my HP already on the second kill of 54 HP. As you can tell my 26 HP, the second kill did not go well. Dude, that Void Waker guy just logged in as I left the cave on my 27 HP. A couple of seconds earlier and he would have killed me. <laughs> That's actually so lucky. Basically what I was trying to explain is that I can use these bears and these ghosts to heal up back to full HP. It does take quite a while and my world gets taken, but it's worth it. I'm not going to lie, I probably should have watched a guide before I started this boss, but it seems like it's going decently right now. I'm at 8kc and I decided to bring purple sweets for extra HP. Using these between kills is going to be vital because it restores between 1 and 3 HP per sweet. Oh come on, one misclick and you take 11 damage. This boss is actually so volatile. I'm not sure if this is going to be possible, I'll take way too much damage. I think that's a special attack that unfreezes the boss. I probably should have watched a guide. But I figured out I could just leave the cave and then go back inside. And then just hit it from behind, it's actually quite good. That should be frozen, I did it as it did the special attack. No it's not, what? A 31 to the dome, this boss is brutal. <laughs> If I have a PK on me while this thing is milling me, I'm actually so dead. I'm at 50k and I'm starting to realise how hard this challenge will actually be. I've had a massive struggle and that's without any PKs. Oh, he's standing on traps, the guy that's trying to steal my world. Oh, he just died to the boss! <laughs> that is karma. Oh no. I've messed up. 50 damage from one attack. Holy fuck. Let's not do that one again. I'm not even joking when I say this. I've hopped every single wood but the Aussie woods, and there is someone inside in every one. It's incredibly active with both PKs and PVMers, with threats being everywhere. It's actually kind of scary. No, the bot just crashed me. I just got crashed by a bot. I so annoying. After finally finding the world, I guess I gotta go hop again. Oh, there's a free world. Oh, there's a PK. Wait, if I get this PK to teleport, then I get that free world. It's actually genius. Oh, well, that was quick. That is one way to get a free world. I will take it. The things you've got to do when it's this active. 100 KC and no uniques yet. And the looting bag is looking kind of clean. I've already got 20 of 21 stackable drops. I don't got to rephrase it. It's going to die. Wait, it's not dead. Nah, don't piss me off. A 35 to the dome. Oh. Oh, Okay. I was complaining about taking damage and I just got an anglerfish and a dark crab drop. Okay, I'll shut up then. Don't you dare. I'm schooling. I don't even care. No wonder loads of people schooled on me when I did that school tricking video. I fucking feel their pain and he teleported. That is what I wanted. Now I risk 1.5 bill though. <laughs> that is not a good idea to do. Oh no. He's actually annoying me. I'm out of combo food now as well. The boss just died. That is really good. Oh, I've got anglerfish. That is perfect. That is really, really needed. He's got a normal whip. What is going on? Okay, there we go. He teleported. My restores is not looking good, but thankfully I got that anglerfish drop. These two Sanfus in my emergency prayer, so I do not want to use them at all. And I've been prayer flicking for the last five kills, but I've only got 25 prayer points left. I'm literally zero prayer points. Please give me a restore. I mean, gave me anglers. That's good as well. Oh, yes. A restore drop. I only had to use one dose of Samfew. That's really, really nice. After all that struggle, I get a back-to-back -back restore drop. Of course I do. I literally can't find a world for the life of me, so I'm going to actually try something extremely risky. I'm going to go towards 65, which is a high-risk world that schools you instantly on login. This means there is 2.1 bill on this world. Let's not get killed here. Let's not get killed at all, actually. Oh. I didn't want to take that 27. There we go. Okay, I've frozen the boss right next to the PK, and I'm going to try and get him to teleport, or I could just KO him. Look at that, 35. Imagine this was me. Okay, he's teleported, finally. 
Oh, okay, it's a different PK with the same name. I guess I've just got to leave. I'm trying to find that medium between not using brews and staying with too low HP. I'm 52 right now. I might be able to get a log. Maybe. Yes, I got the log. That is perfect. Curved bone. I have a feeling that that's going to be very rare. I've just checked in the wiki and it's the most rare drop from this boss. One out of 5k. What the fuck? Oh, this is an awkward time to get my first unique. Do not look at my HP right now. Give me paid, please. Oh, no. I got crashed again. Okay, that's fine. I just wanted to mention that these kills are actually very quick. In just under an hour, I got 43 kills. Which is a lot faster than Spindle and Calvarion. I've done so much damage to him. 300 damage. I can kill this. He's dead. Oh, oh my god. I'm pretty sure I could have just died there. I'm pretty sure I could have just died to the boss. Okay, Reese, you need to wake the fuck up. What am I doing? He's finally teleported there, but I've only got two combo food. And Bro, okay, I've got one combo food. What am I doing? I'm actually a fucking idiot. Sometimes fighting the PK at his back is a good idea, but I need to make sure that boss is frozen and I'm praying Millie, because that was a shit idea. We're back in business now, but we have no combo food. It only took one kill to get the combo food back, and I get nine dark crabs. That's a lot of dark crabs. 250kc and made 9.2 mil, but I actually haven't made that much. I've used 810 sweets, which have been vital for this challenge, but that means I've spent 6 mil on them. Oh no, I'm about to get Millie by the boss. No, I just got mocked back. I'm going to have to use bruise. This is really, really bad. I'm frozen right next to the boss. Fucking hell. And I had to use a brew and a half. I should be fine now because his mystic gear is terrible. But when I got frozen next to that boss, it was brutal. There we go. Finally caught the freeze. Just over a quarter of the way there and I'm only on five and a half brews. That's not very good. As soon as that special happens, you can refreeze it instantly. There's no freeze immunity. I did not actually know this. It only took 278 kills to figure out. I should have definitely looked at a guide. Please splash. I don't want to get frozen. The boss is about to get frozen as well. I might just hit him back. Oh, oh he teleported. What the fuck? Okay, that's why he teleported. He's come back in Ancients. He knows exactly what challenge I'm doing. I should still be able to tank him because the boss is dead right now. Well, I've just realized that my, all my Kwanbans have been going in my looting bag. I wondered why they weren't in my invent. That is really bad. I'm freshly frozen. I keep splashing. I've got no combo food as well. I think that's a full brew that I've already used against this guy. I'm only on 55 HP and he's got one spec left. I can refreeze this, surely. He can't actually merely be here. Yes, perfect refreeze. That was very risky in case I misclicked and somehow got into melee range, but it was good. That is absolutely brutal for this challenge. I put three Kwanbans in my looting bag. Plus, I used all my combo food. One full brew. This is not looking good right now. Mopping around trying to get a free world on four and a half brews and no combo food. So I decided to go back towards 65. It is incredibly scary, but I know for a fact nobody really PVMs here. Also wanted to quickly mention that we are so close to 50k subscribers. So if you are enjoying this content, then please subscribe. I'm really hoping that Ragger is not a scout. I'll be so bad if I get a better PK. Oh, yes. First kill back, I get Anglerfish. That is what I want. I read all the comments down below, and this one is actually perfect for this video idea. I can destroy my looting bag and then get a new one from these rats and then pick it all back up and there's no Kwanbans back in the looting bag. If this works, it's perfect for this challenge. If it doesn't, I'm blaming the comment section. Yes, it actually worked. I got the looting bag. And we got all the loot in there with no Kwanbans. Perfect. Ooh, a Tyrannical Ring. I mean, I'm not going to pick that up. It's only 130k. Oh no, that is the worst time to get frozen. The buyer has just spawned. Why did I freeze it? What am I doing? Oh no, this is bad. Yeah, just a zero. That's actually a lifesaver. I've already used two doses of brew. I'm going to try and SGS him back for HP. I mean, I guess that worked, but yeah, 25 through prayer anyway. This is brutal right now. Please catch the freeze. Yes, perfect. Wait, it's quite low HP. Oh, oh okay. I just wanted to go for a cheeky bolt. Maybe that was a dumb idea. I've just reached 500kc. I'm going to recharge my cert by using the scales inside my staff, as well as charge my web weaver using the F3 in my inventory. Every single RTO kill, I have to freeze the boss multiple times. And after 500kc, I've used over 11k water runes and just less than 9k death runes. This means I don't have enough for the last 500 kills, so I need to try and find a way around this, and I think I've got it. I've figured out if I destroy my looting bag, I can get the death runes from here and the coins. Wait, can he see my loot? There's no way. No, you can see my loot. Oh, no. I'm, he's pulling a heist. He's pulling a heist. He's actually looting my loot. I swear to God, you couldn't actually see my loot. Bro, he's actually looted bear. He just looted the, the Snapdragon seeds, I think. He's actually fucking robbed me. Oh, I'm, I'm fuming. I've lost so much money there. I need the loot in the bag. Look at my inventory. It's just full of loot. Finally, now I can just put it all in the looting bag. That was stupid. I wonder how much I've lost. 
This takes the saying fumble in the bag to a whole different level. I'm pretty sure I just lost like 7 mil there. Now I'm going to walk all the way to Mage Bank. I just simply buy the water runes from here until I've got 16k. We've for sure got enough runes now. Let's go back to RTO. My looting bag looks so barren now, but we've still got 500 kills left to go. I can't believe I just done that. I can't explain how badly I need him to splash right now. No, he caught. The boss is about to spawn. I'm going to start getting millie. This is really, really, really bad. Come on, catch the freeze. This is some really nice gear. Okay, a splash and he caught. I'm going to have to start brewing. I did that for the defense bonus, by the way, to get 115 defense. Nice, I caught. Yes. I'm only on 43 HP, but there's no point eating right now. That is really nice. Another cheeky dragon pick. I froze the boss, so I should be fine. He can't milli me. But he has got a DDS. I need to pray mage. Oh, I had to take that DDS off prayer. Because if I got that prayer wrong, I would have got slung towards the wall. And I would have died there. This man's actually hitting through my tank gear. I had to brew twice. This is really bad. I'm trying to, like, blood barrage back as well. I think I do have the escape right now, though. I'm not the most confident right now. I have three brews and four hard food. That's just not enough. I need to get very lucky with the PKs that hit me. Ooh, Closet Callisto. That's pretty cool to see. 750kc and the looting bag isn't looking the greatest after that mishap, but it happens. Ooh, third dragon pickaxe as I was about to log out for a break as well. I've got a Tyranical Ring and I've got three spots left in my looting bag. I might as well pick it up. No. I just got a Void Waker Hill. 82 mil. I didn't know it was that expensive. Holy fuck. That's the most expensive Void Waker piece by far. That is insane to get just before the actual drop rate as well. I think it's 1 out of 9, 12 for a Void Waker hill. That's sick. This is probably a good time to mention that I'll be giving away all of the loot that I made in this video in my Discord down below. 1,000 KC. That is challenge completed and it was incredibly hard. I made 112.8 mil in total, taking just under 30 hours to complete. If you guys did enjoy, then subscribe. We are so close to 50k and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.